A frightening Christmas Eve morning for a family in Dundalk. Around 2.30, a fire forced them to evacuate. A mom and her two kids are okay, but their grandmother is still in the hospital. 11 News reporter Kim Dacey live at Baltimore County Fire Headquarters in Towson with details on this. Kim? Well, Deb, the timing of the fire on Christmas Eve is unfortunate. The owner says this is a home that has been in her family for several generations, and now the upstairs is completely unlivable. My daughter came and got me. She said, Mommy, this house is filled with smoke. That was around 2 30 Wednesday morning. Mary Diffendahl says she found a dog bed on fire in the front bedroom of her home on McShane Way in Dundalk. She sprang into action right away, knowing her two children and her mother were in the house. Got the kids out, and then um, I thought my, my mother was right behind them. And, you know, I got the dogs, and then I went up, so just, I don't know why I did this, but I guess it's reaction. You want to put the fire out and um, I got a bucket of water and I was just going to throw it and um, then my dad came back down and my daughter said I said where's granny she said she's not down here so Mary ran back into the burning home to find her 73 year old mother she says she kept trying to carry her mother down the steps and out of the house but her mother kept running back up toward the fire when I would lose my breath I would um you know, come down and get a breath and then run back up and I, you know, I left her, you know, at the top of the steps and I had to drag her down and then she would like run off and I don't know why she kept running back to the room. By the time firefighters got to the scene, the whole family was outside. Mary, her three-year-old son and ten-year-old daughter were taken to the hospital, treated for smoke inhalation and released. Mary's mother was unconscious and is still in the hospital. My mother, there, she's elderly, she has COPD anyway. So smoke with inhalation did not help. Fire officials say it appears an unattended candle started the fire, but Mary says she doesn't remember lighting a candle. She and the kids returned home later in the morning to sleep. They're staying in the basement because the upstairs is too smoky and damaged. The timing, Christmas Eve morning, couldn't be worse. Mary says she's planning to delay Christmas this year, but neighbors say they'll take care of the Diffendall family. Bad luck comes in any time of the year, unfortunately. But they'll be all right. Between the four here, we'll make sure they're all right. At last check, fire officials say Mary's mother was listed in critical but stable condition at the hospital. Reporting live in Towson, Kim Day, CWBAL, TV Live News.